out. When two San Diego sisters needed help organizing a sneaker giveaway for military families, they didn't know who to call. In this morning's Zevely Zone, Jeff walks right into this dynamic duo. If you've never heard of the Assistance League, all you need to know is that they're one step ahead of the pack, spreading the good. What do you know about a sneaker giveaway? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> Mary Vicknair from the Assistance League had piles and piles of shoes with no way to kickstart her project. You send me an email, and how fast did I return it? Immediately. And then you called me. Uh, you called me. And then you said to me, wait until you meet my sister. She's a real talker. Oh, Lord, are you serious? Did she say that? <laughs> Mary's sister, Martha, never knew giving away brand new shoes to military family preschoolers in need could be such a battle. We ran into a huge obstacle trying to work directly with the military. There's just a lot of red tape. That's when the nonprofit step stepped in. I was told that you're licensed to operate <laughs> an aircraft carrier. Well, I, I did get qualified to uh, drive an aircraft carrier. Tracy Owens is the program's manager here, but more importantly, a retired Navy lieutenant commander who eats red tape for breakfast. Shoes are expensive. Some of our families have two and three children in toddlers. STEP stands for Support the Enlisted Project. The group specializes in helping military families in crisis, facing evictions, repossessions, and hunger. On Saturday, 200 families will receive 20,000 pounds of food, 7,500 diapers, and new shoes for the kids. Without partners like the Assistance League, we couldn't do what we do. From book drives for underserved students. I'm a retired teacher. Anytime a child gets to read, it makes me so happy. Surprise! To cheering people up throughout the isolation of COVID. You are our sunshine, my only sunshine. The Assistance League uses profits from their thrift shop to talk the talk and this time walk the walk. It's wonderful to see all our hard work and planning for years finally come to fruition. Sometimes you just have to put one tiny foot in front of the other, which is how two San Diego sisters filled some small shoes with huge hearts. Well, we couldn't do it without guys like you, so thank you. I think the theme to this story is anybody at any stage in their life can help yeah, strangers. Definitely. Yes. And it's definitely. so much fun to do it. In the Zevely Zone, Jeff Zevely, CBS 8.